in advanced nations or developing nations, expert doctors are always under a lot of stress because everybody would want to consult them. So how many X-rays or MRI reports or CT scans can an expert scan? So machine learning systems have become extremely good, at least in underdeveloped or developing nations, to churn out, a, to handle massive workloads every day where nothing could have been possible earlier. So for example, in a remote region in India, in a small village, there may be no expert doctor. But in a cluster of village, there might be one doctor. And if he knows machine learning, people can approach him. And that guy doesn't need to consult someone big from a metro. And he can just pass it through machine learning software and identify whether there is a cancerous tumor or not. And then consult a senior. But you will be surprised to know that surprisingly higher degrees of or high degrees of accuracy are now being achieved in medical imaging. Surprisingly high degrees of accuracy. And for people who have no option, this is not a bad option at all. I know it, there are problems, but it's much better than not having any diagnosis at all.